Welcome, Red Devil Nation, here to Tavern 26 for the player profile here with Mahali Coolius. I'm Matt Marr. Mahali, thank you so much here for thank joining us here for the show. Absolutely fantastic that you're here, and we're excited to see how you guys do this season here. And speaking of that season here, we got a new one upon us. Just how excited are you to get back out there on the field here with your teammates, with your brothers? You know, I'm excited. Every, every year, just going out there with my friends, it's just, you know, you can't match it. You know what I mean? It's just... Going out every Friday with my best friends. We're together every day during the season, during practice. It's just, you know, just fun. I love it. Now I'm sure it is out there. Mm -hmm. I'm sure you got that little brotherhood too, yeah. especially since you guys have been together for four years, a lot of you, mm -hmm. you and your leadership group. Speaking of leadership group here, congratulations. We just heard with your coach here that you just got named one of the yep. three team captains. Yeah, it's, it's a big honor, especially, you know, from – there's not a lot – like we had a lot of seniors this year to pick from and just, you know – Knowing that from last year, last year I was a captain too, but, you know, getting voted again just means, you know, I'm doing something right, I guess, so, yeah. And just continuing on here with last year, I mean, are you ready to help these underclassmen, especially these freshmen? You've got a sophomore quarterback I just found mm -hmm. out here. Yeah. I'm sure he's going to need a little bit of help yeah. here because that's a big position, obviously, mm -hmm. right there. That's the person everybody likes to blame when things yeah. are going wrong and everybody loves to praise when things are going mm -hmm. right here. Hopefully it's going to be the louder here for yeah. you guys this season. But, I mean, just are you ready to lead? Are you ready? Is there anything that you have done to prepare yourself here, especially now knowing that you're going to be a captain and just probably expecting, I would assume, mm -hmm. to be named captain again throughout all of training? Yeah, I mean, like, I'm kind of like more of like a team player, I guess. Like I, I want everyone else on my team to succeed, and I know that from, you know, getting voted as captain, especially, I know that it's a bigger role now, and I have to, you know, kind of provide for my team. And, you know, like I'm, I know all the positions in the field. I know all the receiver spots. I played quarterback last year, so I kind of had to. So just knowing that, I know it's going to be. You know, easier to help out my to make my art like a younger classman and stuff. So yeah. And you bring up that you were quarterback last year here. Obviously, a lower body injury mm -hmm. it sidelines you. This year you're coming back here in a new position. What is it? Wide receiver yep. and center? Huh? Are, are a you corner. Ready? Corner. Corner. Okay, yeah. I saw the C here. I yeah. No. <laughs> yeah, I think that's. Yeah. <laughs> coach for that one. <laughs> That's a miscommunication on his side. We'll say that. All right. So, I mean, are you ready for this new role? The responsibilities that come with it? Are you ready to be that wide receiver, the guy that's catching the ball and yeah. scoring the touchdowns? Yeah, for sure. I mean, like, I know I have, you know, I have a good connection with our quarterback, and I know, you know, we're kind of together. We both play corner, and last year he was working with me at quarterback too. So, you know, we're both kind of there, and last year he was one of my receivers as well. So it's kind of still that chemistry that just stays there. So hopefully we'll just, you know, stay together and, you know, we'll work. Yeah, and so we also found out here, again, through your coach, mm -hmm. who was giving us some great information beforehand here, that you're a multi-sport athlete, you track and field here, and basketball as yeah. well. Tell us a little bit about that track and field, first of all. I mean, how'd you get into that, and uh, how are you doing? <laughs> uh, track and field, I mean, we kind of, like, it kind of wasn't really big before, like, when I was in middle school, and my eighth grade year, we kind of were just like, oh, like, all my friends were like, oh, let's go do track. So we all kind of got into it. And we all, I mean, we were all really good. Like, we, we won our conference that year. And, you know, we had a great team. And then, you know, freshman year, a lot more people kind of just came with it. And we kind of just rebuilt our whole track program. So, you know, it was it was nice to see that. And right now, like, we've been doing really good. We were making it out of districts and stuff. You know, like, last year, our 4 by 2 team with the state, I wasn't in it because I got hurt. But they, I was a part of it before. And then after, you know, we've been doing really good since then this year. We went to regionals in our four by two or our four by one. I'm sorry, and yeah, that's really it. And in basketball, I mean, I, I love I love keeping busy. You know what I mean? I love staying in shape. You know that kind of just helps with football, track, even basketball too, because yeah. it's kind of they're all running sports. So I kind of need to stay in shape and just keeps my body nice too. So yeah. And obviously, I'm sure with that track and field as well, that's helping you out here with that wide receiver because you got to run down that yeah. field. you got to outpeat everybody to mm -hmm. make those grabs. Mm -hmm. I and mean, that's not an easy position at mm -hmm. all here. So, I mean, I'm sure that's going to help you just having that background as well. Yeah. So I'm just kind of curious here. we got three uh, three sports here that you like to play. Mm -hmm. I'm not going to tell anybody if you don't, other than the people that are watching. Uh -huh. What's your favorite? Football, 100%. Football, 100%. Yeah, I love There's it. There's yeah. no doubt in your mind, no basketball. Yeah. You just didn't know a hint. No, football. Well, hey, yeah. that's great to hear here. Yeah. I mean, hey, it's football season after all. I mean, you're yeah. excited, and now, now yeah. we know that this is number one for you. So, do you have any friends, family here? Obviously, you got your teammates, but I see a big open room here. Yeah. Anybody yeah. here that's here supporting well, all the over show? There. Or? All over there is all my family. I, my mom, I want to thank my brother, my sister. You know, they've always been there for me, and they're always, you know, we, we're really close. And then my grandpa's here, my aunts, and like, my uncles are here. And also, I want to thank Jacob, Primo, Cristo, Lackey over there. Caleb, Malik, they're all my best friends. Kevin, too, coming up next, so yeah. That's great to hear here. Now, out of all these people here that you listed, who would you say is your biggest 
like source of support? Uh, my mom. Your mom, big yeah, time. Yeah, she's yeah, she's sacrificed so much for us, and she's always there. You know, no matter what we're fighting or something, she's always there, no matter what. So I know if I can call her up, she'll always be there in a second. So yeah. That's great to hear. Family is always important here. Your coach mm -hmm. is a family man. You are too, it seems, which is great yeah. to hear. Yeah. And I mean, obviously, that was your biggest sports source of support. Now, let's move forward here. Who would you say has been your biggest role model, your biggest inspiration, the person that you're striving like, hey, I want to be like this person right here when I grow older or as I continue to grow older here, obviously, being a senior, you're up there here. Yeah. So, I mean, I want to say my mom again because, you know, she's just such a hardworking person and everything that you know, like, everything that goes bad, like, she's always just still pushing through, and she, no matter what, she'll do anything that she doesn't like just to make sure she provides for me and my family, so, yeah. That's great to hear mm -hmm. right there. I'm sure she's going to love to hear that yeah. when we get this one up there live. <laughs> <laughs> all right, so moving a little bit off track here, just something I wanted to ask you as well. So we all we know who your biggest sport, we know who your role model is off the field. Who's your favorite professional athlete out there? Is there anybody who maybe you find some inspiration from as well in your like, sport, whether it be football, uh, basketball, soccer, baseball, any sport? doesn't matter. Um, just in general. It could be present, old. I'm just in general is all heck here. I love Joe Burrow. Joe, Joe Burrow, Burrow, yeah. yeah he's, got that Cincinnati connection. Yeah, yeah. He's, he's been, I love the Bengals, and I always loved Joe Burrow ever since he came. I just love how he is. I love his attitude and how he's always, you know, there for his team. So I just, I just, yeah, I just love you, my favorite. You guys getting a Super Bowl coming up uh, here hopefully, soon? Hopefully, yeah. Almost had one a hopefully. few years ago there. I know, almost. It's coming close for you yeah, guys, I'm sure. Say, yeah. Up here in Cleveland, not so close. Nah. But, hey, you know what? <laughs> You're happy about that, which yeah. is all that matters right now. All right, we've got one more question before we let you go here. Mm -hmm. Got this great menu here from Tavern 26, the host of our show, the Red Devil Show. Thank you again for hosting us here at Tavern 26. Come check them out here in Camel on 12th Avenue, or 12, pardon me, 12th Street. Curious here. Obviously, you've been here several times before. Yeah. I would assume, right? Mm -hmm. That's a safe assumption. All right, good. All right, we don't got a we don't have a rookie here. We got a pro. <laughs> Curious here. What's your favorite menu item? What's something on here that you would recommend to anybody? First time, second time, hundredth time doesn't matter. On here, and if you can't think of one, what on here looks the best? Just off the name. All right, I just ordered food, so I I just got the trash can nachos. Those are my. I kind of always been getting those, and I got the dry ranch wings. I love their, their wings here. I Every time I come here, I get yeah, them. They got a special, I think, on them tomorrow, too. I mean, uh, yeah, I know. Those wings are always popular. Tomorrow, yeah. Yeah. I mean, you can't get enough of them here, it seems. Yeah. yeah. Nah, their wings. I like the trash can nachos. And, I mean, a burger usually is pretty good, too. That's uh, all I've I usually get. I've had their burgers before, too. Yeah, they are yeah, very I, good. Yeah. I can't pick my favorite. I love the dry ranch wings, though. So I think I'm going to have to go to dry ranch. That's awesome to hear. I saw people. I saw them bringing out those nachos. They're probably yours here. That has a huge tray here. Yeah. This place, Tavern 26, they give you a lot of bang for your buck. Mm -hmm. I mean, definitely worth it here. I mean, you're paying eight, ten dollars, something like that here for just that, and you're getting a whole lot that you can share with two or three of your friends, and you're yeah. all going to be full. Mm -hmm. I mean, 100 percent. Definitely, we recommend you checking out Tavern 26, our gracious host here for the Red Devil Show and for our player profile. Oh, Mihalis here. Thank you yep. so much. Thank for coming you. on and joining us here mm -hmm. for this player profile for our show. Good luck for this season here. We can't wait to see you out there catching all those touchdowns. Yeah, for sure. It's going to be a lot of fun here for, for you, sure. and it's going to be a lot of fun for us here on YSN. Yep. Well, thank, thank you, so guys. Much. Thank you very much. Yep. Thank you, Absolutely. YSN. And thank you, Tavern 26. And thank again. you, Tavern 26.